people have been saying that these protesters are in the wrong, stating that they are spreading COVID. To these people, I need to say you are not seeing the bigger picture. I've been working in a hospital since before this pandemic. I have worked on COVID, non-COVID wards and in ICU. And like everyone, especially healthcare workers, I do not want to see another wave. Saying that, what this government has done and how they are taking advantage of the people of this country is abominable. To start with, Johnson said herd immunity, expect your loved ones to die and protect the economy. Not taking anything seriously, waiting too long to do anything, leaving the NHS without sufficient PPE resulting in both public and NHS dying unnecessarily. U-turn after U-turn. Eat out to help out. Protect the economy, resulting in another lockdown. Opening Christmas shopping. Protect the economy, resulting in another lockdown. Creating illegal contracts and not being held accountable. Prolonging this longer than needed. Proof being that many countries are now COVID-free. And now this government, after tearing the country into pieces, are trying to pass a bill that will mean people will no longer publicly voice their opinions without being deemed a nuisance and receiving prison time and make it harder for nomads to live their lives just to make them conform. When plans for the protest first came out, the police threatened to arrest people for breaking COVID regulations as if the bill has already passed. I do not condone violence, but when you take away people's lifestyles, I understand the anger. I understand when police send in an army and this could be the last chance for people to make a noise and stand up for what is right. A virus is the last thing on their minds. You need to note, some are angry enough to become violent but the majority there are peaceful and just need to be heard. Stand up for your rights. 